I'm the disc golf guy. 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 And this is my video vlog. I'm the disc golf guy, and this is my video blog. I'm joined by our two champions of the XMS Open. So let's first start with last year's champion, Steve Valencia, the other Steve Valencia, we'll say, right? The real Steve Valencia. The real Steve Valencia. Steve, last year there was a lot of chatter on Facebook, and you stepped up and you took down the tournament, beating the likes of, we'll say Steve Rico, for instance. And you came out as the dark horse, and on top, I promised you a video blog, here you are. What was that like for you? Uh, it was a great experience, you know. Uh, Steve's one of my best friends. Uh, I look up to him, and uh, it was kind of bittersweet, you know. I, I went to the playoff, and I got him in the first hole, but he's one of my best friends, so it was kind of bittersweet for me. So Steve Valencia wins it last year, which, uh, like I said, some people went to guest on, but you came through in the clutch. And now we're going to move on. You're, you're figuratively passing the baton on to our second year champion here with Philo Brathwaite. Philo, you managed to also conquer the same Steve Rico. Tell us about that. That guy is not to be played with, man. That guy never quits. He could be five, six, seven strokes, and he's just going to keep coming after you. He doesn't get up. That's a great challenge for anybody, any of us top pros or any pro in general who's having a good tournament to have somebody on you like that. You pull out a victory, and it fires on you. It's good to get those kind of wins. So. so you came out hot. You shot really well at over at the Silmar course. And this year, unlike last year, we came to Verdugo Hills for the second round, and you just barely edged him out. Talk yeah. a little bit about the course here. I mean, we see rollaways, we see lots of things and OBs out here. Lots of OB. Talk about the, the maybe the courses here and what you experience. It's, it's deceivingly difficult for the length of the shots. You think, oh, it's 300 feet, but then there's a green 10 feet away from the basket, or you know, there's a cliff that goes 150 feet down a hill to your right, right there. It's, there's so much danger on such short holes. So it can really be anybody's game. You have a bad putt that catches a bad roll, and, give up a stroke, you know, you throw a good drive, it looks good, doesn't clear the green, you get a stroke that way, there's some paths and creeks and stuff that come into play, so there's a lot of obstacles to get around at this course, so as easy as it may look visually, <laughs> actually playing the course is a lot harder than it looks, you got to be spot on, you know where you want to land, really anticipate the different grades on the hills of the shot, so. You obviously navigated that very well. We had 88 people out here for the second year event, uh, primarily sponsored by Legacy Discs. Is there anything uh, anything we can look forward to uh, in the in the next year, maybe for the, the third annual? Steve, you got anything to say to that? Yeah, I'm gonna come back and take my title back. <laughs> okay, wow, big, big talk here from Steve. Philo, what do you have to say about that? Normally I don't have, you know, two year champions back to back, but what do you have to say? Are you gonna be back next year to defend? Uh, I'll come back and defend, but this is golf, keep in mind, anything can happen, so I'm not gonna put it past him. Anybody can have a good weekend and come out here and shoot it up, so this just happened to be my day. I had a good start and was able to just barely hold on. So like I said, Rico's a strong competitor, but you never knew he might come out next year and shoot it up, so just uh, have to wait and see. Absolutely. Well, we've got Philo, we've got Steve, the real Steve Valencia. I'm the Disc Golf Guy. It's been an amazing time out here hanging out in Southern California. Hopefully I can find a way to come back in future years. Seems like perfect timing in December. We're getting six to eight inches of snow in Wisconsin as we're filming this. And it's uh, 60 degrees. You guys are calling that cold. Oh, it's uh, freezing out here. <laughs> it's a little chilly out here. Okay, it's a little chilly. That's why I'm always packing the, uh, the winter layer wherever I go. All right, we've got Steve Valencia. We've got Philo Brathwaite. i got to thank uh, all the guys over at Legacy for help getting us here this year. I've got to thank my awesome host, cameraman, uh, in Ben Ferris. Thank you guys so much. I'm the Disc Golf Guy, Philo, Steve, our previous champions, and we'll catch you guys hopefully next time. And Merry as Christmas. always, Merry Christmas. Play with confidence.